I've been a centrist. Not a complete centrist, it's been right leaning. Okay. But I've been a centrist the entire time. So basically boring. Hey, I, I make the history videos here. Whoever's saying them, I'm, I'm a commie and shit. Okay. Don't get off topic. We'll get to that. Okay. Mine is the same as Sasa, actually. So basically, we've got two centrists and someone who's working with communists. Got it. I mean, I honestly don't give a shit about politics. No, I don't even know why I'm here. People. Look, they, they are art imitates my style, if you want to understand it. And this, this is art. This is all, all of this is art. It's artistic. Alright, second question. Um, and this is actually the one I was going to get into, Jay, so you'll you'll be glad to get this question. But what, what have you done for the server so far? Because obviously we had no politics up until this point. So this is just a really a test of your well your person. What have, what have you all done? I'll let Jay go oh, first. Oh, overall? Here. Well, yeah, I mean... Some of your contributions. I mean, I do mean everyone. We'll go on I've over. helped uh, lead an entire 14 group uh, to the world border um and um i it, that took like a month and a half to do uh it was quite fun actually um i made several history videos um that have um uh, all together have like like thousands of views on youtube right now um and um, well, I've also made, uh, Shack Fortress, which was a really fun, um, uh, mini-event, um, that has, uh, <clears throat> helped out new players at spawn, and also just giving us, uh, a reason to all come together as a community and do stuff. I've made, uh, the Thanksgiving event, uh, twice, um... And, um, 30 seconds. I've, um, <clears throat> I've also helped, uh, make, uh, Infinite Ikea with Sasa, discover, um, a few dupes, um, with and him as well, and, uh, yeah, um, befriended many, um, players throughout the years, right, I and, oh, okay, there. okay. Uh, who do I want to go next? Uh, Ouchie, you can go next, if you'd like. Alright, so, I, I, hi I, Danny. Who are you? Like, like, what's your... What? Oh, you're Danny, okay. Yeah, I'm Danny. Oh, what's up with you, dumbass? Quit shooting me, please. Alright, hi Danny, I've already started to help the server, and I've already started to work on my promises. I have... Made the server way more suitable. I've fixed up the Nether Hub, and I've given tons of players new kits. And I've gotten a whole lot of players to stay on 66k. I've also helped TFK with some of like the lagging issues that we've had. And I've been such a help in the past month that that Rob gave me a contributor role on the server, which I am I'm very I'm very happy about. And I've. I brought tons of new players to together, establish, establishing a political group on the server, and I will, they all will help me with certain tasks like draining the nether spawn, and maybe even like fixing and repairing the nether highways, and maybe even expanding them. Thank you. Okay, very good. Thank you. And uh, will you help rebuild the shack fortress? Sasa, you're up. All right, I'm Sasa, but you know who I am. Been on the server since yeah, about so, April of 2017. Uh, my first contribution contribution was probably in what am I floating? It was probably in the Demon War, though I wasn't doing much then. Uh, Nedril, my new president right now, uh, declared war on me when I was about 11 years old. I'm still 11 right now, but further after that, I took a break from the server. I was chilling low with Jay for most of the time and to uh, establish old ikea which is now a pivotal point in the server history because it established multiple dupes in the server uh was a founding member of the anarchitects which was a very good um group for the server because it established spawn bases which wasn't really a thing at the time since 
nevergreen in the old days. And voting for me will establish a new point in time where we'll develop history systems and systems that are going to help new players develop, like the new fact foundation. We're going to build new community bases, new spawn bases, just like the Anarchitects, just like Nevergreen. These aren't just looking at history through rose tinted glasses. This is pushing history forward in a way that respects the old history and moves that in a further point in the time. Oh, yeah, I've also made infinite Base. IQ, which Base. is uh, also a contribution. Base. Um, okay. Shut the fuck up, Bitcoin fool. He's based. Oh, by the way, if anyone if anyone in the audience wants to make a trivia question, just go right ahead. Just put them in public debate and then ping me and I'll think if it's a good one or not. Stop spinning. Be respectful. <laughs> Smite them. Yeah, I, I, I <laughs> figured. Hold on, let me put this fire out. Yeah, more. that man's God. If you if you disobey him, he he will kill you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me just keep him through right there. Do not call TFK sus. He will. He... All right. We've got our stand-in from Mike, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, okay, we'll, we'll slip in this question over here. Just very briefly, what's the coolest or best thing you've built on this server? Um, um, yeah, okay. Hold on. I think for the rest of the debate, let's just do it in... Uh, like one, two, three. You know what I mean? Okay. Like this order, yeah. you so, you're up. Oh, the coolest thing I've built? Yeah. Well, this is more of a group effort, but um, recently, like very recently, I won't dwell too much in the past because, you know, uh, progress can always be made. Recently, within like the last year or so, probably before that, six months or so, I've been to the end and I've made probably what I would say is the most well-kept end base on the server history. It's called Olympia and it's essentially a grassy platform with very good terraforming skills that was just a really well base and the fact that you know it was just made in my spare time it's just a small little side project uh, I brought in a lot of other people to come and see it. My trust in the community is like a lot, so I trust that it won't get griefed, and it hasn't been griefed. It's still standing to this day. And we've all gone there, like an architect style, just gone in there, bomb rushed it, build, build a bunch of shit, and have it look good. And if anyone wants, I can post pictures just for everyone to see it. It's really cool. It is a pretty I've cool base. Ready. Yeah, sure. Cool. Okay. That's all That's I have. Yeah. Uh, who's next? Oh, can, can I go? What? Bruh. You can go, go Jay. Okay. Um. Well. Um. A lot of um builds I've made are uh been quite small. Um. I mean, I had one build that was gigantic, um, but um, I mean, I'm not gonna get into detail about that one. I mean, you you know what happened to it. Um, yeah, <laughs> um, we do know what happened to it. It, be... <laughs> um, it only existed. <laughs> it it existed, and then you decided it didn't have to exist. Yeah, but yeah. Um, <clears throat> what would you say is your best? Um, but my best build, um, Sorry, I, didn't mean to that. I mean, my, my favorite build would have to be, um, the, uh, Shack Fortress bases. Um, they, they don't really look, um, anything too 
amazing, but um, the reason why I think of them as, like, my best is because it actually um, had a purpose in its life, and it actually um, brought a community together, which is something that I always strive to do whenever I'm um, whenever I'm trying to no, shut up, Bitcoin full. I, I really do want to help this community. Whenever I, I, whenever I try to do something on the server, I always want other people to be involved as well. So, like, making spawn bases like Shack Fortress is probably the most accomplished feelings I get. And... Gonna have to cut you off there, Jay. Yeah. yeah. Bitcoin full, you suck on fucking Danny's dick all day. <laughs> what? All right. Um. Also, please leave the area. Dang. <laughs> all right, I'm ready. Oh. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Please me. I'm trying to make a speech here. I'm sorry. Uh oh. There's been. Oh shit. Okay. There's been a fire. There's been a fire. <laughs> TFK, there's been a fire. Fear not, we're all okay. good. <laughs> so, most of my builds have been for the players in 66k. I try to avoid making bases that aren't public, and I s tend to spend most of my time building, doing spawn projects, like repairing the obby roof and repairing the nether hub and draining spawn. But I have built like four bases with Puzza and I've helped with Bong Town and I've made two of my bases on my, or I've made two bases on my own called Danny Town and a unnamed base made by EQ and I. But I will be making lots of bases in in the in the future that'll be like completely public. They'll be like spawn bases. So if anyone wants to help me with that, we can do I, that. I will definitely Let me be helping out with spawn bases you, 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 even if you win don't interrupt hey 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 I I, I I i i can i at least just say this no go for it <laughs> i'll well, let you this is my time we'll, to speak we'll, with we'll have an open-ended like conclusion part okay fine but also he was taking um all right did that not break Wait, my arm hold on let me just add loyalty Not not the intent, but I mean, loyalty. I should probably put that on. Eh. Okay. Yeah. So we've seen a little bit of the past. I think now it's a good time to move into the uh, future plans. Uh, Ouchie, please no campaigning in the middle of the city. All right. So here's 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 a good question because I was working on this for a little while. Spawn. It's a bit of a mess right now. You tried pulling it up to high health and never got around to it, and then I left. What are your plans for spawn? Specifically, looking something more like what are we going to do with the spawn roof? Should we turn it into a giant hole? Uh, here's a hint yes, you should turn it into a giant hole. You know, what are your plans? You know, if you want to build some sort of obsidian structure, it's something like that. Just describe your plans for spawn, because that's really something that attracts a new player. Oh. I All would right, like to for... talk. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Hey. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So, I don't, I don't want to leak all of my plans, but I'll tell you some of the stuff that I've been working on in the past week. So, me and lots of players, like Cryocells, Tiny Pet, and Dioza, and NVC, we've been, we've been working on spawn, like a ton. We've been, we repaired the Nether Hub and we've been draining uh, nether spawn like all throughout this week and i i also have tons of other plans in the future but i don't want to leak like too many but i will say is that we're making an obby we're making like uh excuse me we're making like a a giant obsidian logo in this in the sky for my political party okay that's i'm gonna be honest that's pretty cringe in fact, it's, it's so cringe, I'm probably going to end up blowing it up. 
Uh, why why would you do that? Uh, because I can't. Yeah. Okay, okay. Jay, you're up. Okay, Jay's up. Well, um, like we said before, um, Hydro uh, really wants to um, blow up um, a 500 radius of spawn all the way down to bedrock. Um, and I also very much agree with that as well. And, um, and then having uh, spawn bases um, on the outskirts uh, of, of the area. Actually, Bitcoin, well, I was the guy who came up with Shack Fortress, uh, the, the spawn bases and shit, so you can suck it. All right, uh, yeah. hold on. Let's, let's hold a quick vote. Everyone, if you think we should mute Bitcoin Pool, come to this side. If you don't think we should mute Bitcoin Pool, come to this side. Alright, the voting is literally unanimously in favor of muted him. Goodbye. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Good democracy here. Alright, anyway, um, yeah, fucking, uh, by the way, okay, so, uh, Danny, you're up. No, no, it's, it's Sasa. Wait, hold on. Okay, so it's Sasa, yeah. Yourself. Okay. Yeah, I thought he was Sasa. <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I will work closely with anybody who is willing to participate. Even if I am not available, because I am, I will admit I'm a busy man sometimes. Much like Hydro, much like I won't say Nedril, I'm not as busy as Nedril. But I will put all yeah, biases I, aside. Hold, hold on, I, I think Bitcoin is evading the mute by using a separate account. I don't care, hold on, I'll mute that one too. Thank you. Anyway, go ahead, sorry. I will put all biases aside. Any teams don't exist in this matter, I will say. But what are you planning on doing? What I'm planning on doing? I think it would be awesome that in combination with Hydro's plan, if I were to win, I would very much work closely with Hydro in having two plans at once with the destruction up to bedrock within the 500 block radius of spawn and extending the spawn radius to form a giant swastika because I think that would look badass. Okay, that's cringe. Um, it's not, actually, it's, I kind of like that idea. Not cringe. It's awesome, be more, actually. Be more creative. Come up with a more creative goal. All right, chat. Let's turn spawn into a giant TFK face. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> not using is cringe. Okay, so here, here's what I'll say. Anyone who succeeds at blowing up spawn to hell, found a bedrock as my vote. Like, so yeah, just, like right now? No, not right now. It take it'll take weeks. Trust me. I actually tried doing this with automated TNT troopers. It takes weeks because the problem is you can't clear off much of the area, and so you have to do like three different passes. Yeah. How tall spawn is? You have to do a pass at like Y. Equals, I've already actually world edited off all the blocks above Y equals two fifty six. You have to do a pass at like two fifty two sixty. And then like 200, and then like 160, and like even lower. It's a real pain in the ass. But that's all I'll say. If anyone has the dedication to do that, I respect it. Well, we'll try. Yeah, we'll okay. Give it our all. <clears throat> oh, I'm now realizing that in the notes Bob sent, he actually asked me not what not. Said, don't ask that. He's already been asked before. That's kind of embarrassing. Or whatever. I will say, What's the that? destruction of spawn will be used in conjunction with the working of new players. Yeah. I'll put all yes. new players to work. For sure, I, I do think that goes to unanimous. Strategy. I I have forty uh, supporters, so me and all my supporters we could totally bomb the spawn. Yes, you can join my Discord, TFK. I have 40 support supporters. 40 here. people. Do they actually play the server? Like 90% of them do. Jesus. Okay, that's. I know. I'm winning by a landslide. There's a reason for it. 
Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to definitely check that. <laughs> yeah, puzzle. Puzzle. Thank you, puzzle. I appreciate that. Um, because, yeah, 40 players is a lot of people. But anyway, let's move on. Um, Treader, I'm not gonna ask about doxing. That's up to a lot. Um, what am I gonna use about the N word? So, Nidro is the N word. I'm gonna do that. God, you guys have awful questions. Uh, Treader, okay, fine. What's your opinion on the value of 36 raw pork shoulders? <laughs> <laughs> he really wants this question answered. You're up. I love inflation. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's it. honest. We will, def <laughs> we will <laughs> inflate the price to 37 raw pork shoulders. Okay, that's um, I actually said yeah. that last debate, so you're kind of just copying me now. Well, also, that's deep. 38 raw pork chokers. Again, again, that's deep. Okay, okay. This man mm -hmm. might mm -hmm. like... He's just copying me. This, this man might like his inflation, but I guarantee you, pyramid schemes, everybody. Let's go. We'll have all of the raw pork chops now. Thank you, Jim. Okay, and uh, your uh, whichever one fucking out to you. Bitcoin full. How many alt accounts do you have? <laughs> yeah, Danny. How many alt? Yeah, that's that's a lot. By the way, tell them. Bro, it's not even me. Don't even. You're just hating TFK. Huh? You can check our pings, bro. You can check our pings. Yeah, that's fine. But how, um, what's your opinion on the pork chops and all that? So I noticed that a lot of people have just straight copied my ideas. In the last debate, 37 pork chop, raw pork chop is going to be the new currency. 37 raw pork chop? It's kind of mm -hmm. awesome, isn't it? It's, it's better, bro. There's one more. It's one more than the original, and more equals better. You know? Thank you. Just so I don't get confused. Okay, um, next question. All right, here's a big one, and this is going to seem like a loaded question, but it isn't. Um, so actually answer this honestly. How do you think 6A6K should be operated? Do you like more of a Rob style or a TFK style? Do we prefer less admin intervention, or do we prefer a little more chaos? I okay. believe, I'll go this first, I'll go first. Not a loaded question, so you can't answer honestly. What? What? Like, if you say Rob style, I'm not gonna kill you with something. Oh, okay, okay. Like, it's it's a legitimate question. You don't know I that. think that all through the course of 6A6K history, going back all the way to 2017, what has given 6A6K the most character is its admin interference. The fact that we have never truly been a 100% anarchy server has driven and kept a lot of players under the server. Admin interference has always been a part of 6 k culture, and for that reason, uh, I am in support of admin interference. Okay. I, I kind of have to agree with Sausage on this one. Um, it's always been, like, the, the funniest moments that happened on 6 a 6 k were always the parts where, um, um, like, admin intervention happened in shit, and even the parts where like admin intervention was bad at least it kind of got us um, like talking about the server and stuff like that um like for for one moment like um i know dan that was like the first meme on 6a6k and like i remember uh tfk um kicking everybody with the prompt saying dino dan is upon you and that became like the biggest meme on the server so yeah i agree admin intervention is pretty funny uh, big point well, i will not be asking that question on account of my status as a white suburban male okay also, so also wait wait hold on hold on hold on can we just let me just pause for a second this big point we'll talk about what we're going to do about the bitches and then he just dies and spawns. 
<laughs> Dude, a dying has spawned people. I mean, fun. I'm really gonna allow this place to be fucked. Alright, anyway, uh, Danny, you're up. So, when TFK got really busy, the server really died. There was like nobody on for a little while. So, I really think that admin's playing is like really, really important. So, I think admin interference is beneficial. So, I agree with both of you. All right, cool. I was hoping we'd actually have some people like with dissenting opinions there, but it seems like pretty much everyone thinks the same. Glad to hear it though. <laughs> Let's go. So here's another question, and this is more looking forward. Um, world generation. Obviously, right now, every, uh, I don't know if a lot of the newer players know this, but 6A6A used to have a custom generator plugin called Open Terrain Generator, which hasn't been developed for a long time actively, so we can't use that. But there are other options. Right now we're on the vanilla generator. Should we switch to the new generator? Because there are advantages and disadvantages. What do you think? I think that the use of open terrain generation would prevent uh, exploits in the future, such as people obtaining the world seed and using that to uh, contact bases. And also, oh, it's well, always it it more difficult, but it doesn't stop it entirely. Yeah. Really? Oh, it's well. Still coded, it's but it's just harder. a lot harder. Yeah. Regardless, uh, nope. terrain generation has been given 6A its own little quirk. 6A has always been like this niche little corner in the anarchy community. And bases have been founded upon it. Old IKEA was actually founded on an OTG structure. So I believe it could help in that factor. Jay? Yeah. Um, open terrain generator. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's... Uh, op open terrain generator. Uh, it's just a great um, Bitcoin pool. Please. Yeah, unfortunately, we can't use it, but there are other options that actually update reasonably quickly, so we won't be lost in time in the future. Yeah, you're a bitch. Bitcoin pull, we get it. <clears throat> anyway. Um, <clears throat> Open Terrain Generator has always been a part of the personality of uh, 6A, 6K, and I feel like getting rid of it um, was... Um, it, it is just a really bad idea in general. Like, um, when we first were talking about, like, um, switching versions, like, I, I remember we all, like, unanimously agreed, like, yeah, no, we, we want to keep the, um, the custom terrain and stuff, but we inevitably switched to the, to it, and we got some, um, vanilla terrain, and honestly, that kind of just sucked away at the, the feel of 6a 6k so having having some sort of um custom terrain um either from like um an actual um team of mod developers or like somebody in the community makes their own uh custom terrain just custom terrain should always be a part of 6a 6k's formula that's what i'm trying to say okay and Danny, you're up. I think that custom train is good because when people talk about 6A6K, they know it as a server with, with custom train. It's what it's always been. And I think it should just stick stay like that. Because it's what it's it's what we're known for, and it's been like that since the start. Give 6A6K quirks again. Yes. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll actually look into that tomorrow, assuming I'm not super fucking busy, which I probably am. Hold on, let me just do something real quick. Uh, roommate, what's your question? Oh, wait, hold on. Is EQ running? Yeah, is, EQ's is running. He's my, he's my VP, is. actually. So, so he's VP, okay. He, can stay he, sh here. he should come up next to me and then. He should 100% turn his mic on. Okay, you can sound like my friend. EQ mic up. Mic up, EQ. Yeah. 
Oh, you know he didn't ask. Pick He's raising his hand. He's raising his hand. Get him up here. Oh, wait. He says he has to, like, you put him in the thing. Uh, um, how's that? I, I noticed that uh, you guys don't have your, your VPs. Your, 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 your just pointing it out there. You're just dead. Yes, I do. You're done. You're done. You're just going out. <laughs> Walk. Bitcoin hole. Bitcoin full, you're a part of that. Bitcoin full? Yeah, I was just about to say. Little guy. Anyway. Um. Wait, crewmate, what's your Discord username? I don't know what your name is. Or? <laughs> We're not asking that question, only because it'll take me five minutes to describe. Anyone have like any actually like relevant? relevant actually, uh, Neo 16's uh, question is pretty good, I think. Oh, yeah, any solutions? Well, actually, I'm gonna be honest, I've actually already applied a solution, it's just that you know, it's kind of hard to tell. But there's a, a solution has been applied, that's all I'll say. I, I, I think we should um, start applying this um, admin, interfe admin interference um, by. Um, um, creating a command block that just slash kills Bitcoin full repeatedly. Well, actually, what he doesn't realize is for like the last five minutes, he's been ghost muted. So actually, none of us can see him talking. That's why he's shut up recently. <laughs> yeah, I think it's called ghost mute. It works really well. Oh, okay, <laughs> nice. The best part is it's so silent that like you can't even like see the messages in console. <laughs> Also, for some reason, like, slash op just isn't a command anymore. Is that just not a thing in 1.1? And he left the game. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't think, I don't yeah, think it is. Exactly. Yeah, well, EQ is well. raising his hand. Uh, okay. oh. EQ is raising his hand. Let the man speak. Let him cook. Oh, he, he wants to be put in the... Yes, I've said that. Oh. Yeah. Uh, shit. Did I just? Hello, gentlemen. Hey. EQ the man, the goat. What's up? <laughs> yeah, here's a good question. Like, what's your PPP record? Mine. I'm very generous. Because this is what the new the new players care about. PvP. So I've been distributing tons of PvP kits around spawn, and I'm normally pretty active with PvP people. Like this is, uh, I'm on my um, like, what's it called? Like a fresh account, so I can't really pull up my statistics. But I'm a big PvPer in 66k. People like, uh, hold on, like Puzzle can confirm. So Karen, uh, let me look. Oh, oh, yeah, Coop Dog. He can confirm as well. We PvP is spawn. Okay. Thank you, Dan. Unfortunately, you did answer out of order, so I'm gonna have to say it. You're up. I have 47 kills. Uh, I don't PvP that much. I'm more of a builder. If you're a part of the server, you know this. <laughs> I organize things. That's pretty much it. Uh, and uh, Joe, um, I'm currently looking up my statistics on player kills. Um, why am I Why am I reading the equivalent of a fucking MCAT question? Surprisingly, I I have 114 player kills on the server, even though I'm most likely the most shit at PvP. Yeah, yeah so I have 427. You go, King. All right. Um, Word, thank you for that question. Unfortunately, I'm not in medical school yet, so I don't know the answer to that. Damn. <laughs> when 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 is uh, TFK becoming um, uh, a medical professor and getting billions upon billions of dollars? I, I would shit my pants if I look at my surgeon. Money. It's fucking TFK. It would actually be plausible. We don't live that far apart. Uh, 
Oh, swear, what's the answer to that hey, one? no rigging. No, I'm, I'm, I'm... Is it? I feel like it's probably... Versailles, you can't, you can't rig the boat e here. E or A. It's just a bribe, man. It's just a... It's just a scam, man. Because the foot ulcer is a thing for, for diabetes. I know that causes that. But I don't know what the exact cause of it is. But I'm probably not pushing your uh, tobacco use. Probably not patient weight. Not that bad. So oh my it's god, it's high. Probably the end, right? I'm glad to make it. Oh my god, she he, he actually made it, guys. What's he, what are you making? Uh, is this the puzzle throne? Hold on, let me look up the answer to this critical Hold question. On, I'll be back in a second. No, that's not it. it... It's neurologic findings, right? Because they don't realize that they're nerve deficient. That's probably it. Anyways. Uh, any, any, other any other questions we have? Uh, so I gotta go. I also realize that there's only two people in the audience that, uh, that are not voting me. So, see y'all. You know who to vote for. Bye. <laughs> I respect the kind. What a crazy thing. Yeah. Also, hey guys, it's me, Natural. I, I finally made it. It's okay. So does, anyone else, does anyone have else? And if anyone else have anything to say today, or can we move on to whatever the fuck comes after? Uh, right? Yeah, uh, Russia is uh, is Bitcoin full. I'm I'm almost positive. Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure this debate has just degenerated into complete chaos. So vote for Nedril, and I will put new players to work. Hey guys, we can, I'm Nedro. We can, in the final stage of the debate. We vote, uh, vote Hydro. He's, he's a cool person. He's he's yeah. Brazilian and he's pretty cool. Um, I'm I'm just uh, yeah. I'm gonna go before we start getting crystal and shit. So no, 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 so, yeah. you can't go. You have to fight out the PVP. Begin PVP immediately. No water. You know what is a president who can't defend himself? You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Uh, okay, who the fuck is posting organic chemistry? I actually learned this once. That's an oxidation reaction, so you get a... Hey, Bitcoin pool, do you like Dungeons and Dragons? Damn. I'll, I'll teach you how to play Dungeons and Dragons. Great fun. Mm. Eh. 6A6K D and D will happen. I I promise. E e even if I don't win, like honestly, I I oh I um I I, I come I I leave for like five. I, I leave for like two minutes and the entire stage is gone. Yeah, well, we had a little bit of a PvP fight. Um, but anyway, I think that's about all for this case. I think you all can participate in. Uh, what, what the fuck do you want whenever you do that thing? Yeah, Rob, Rob, you missed the entire thing. Also, there's no more stage anymore. I just pulled everyone's PvP. Um, so thank 